congratulations po for the visa movement. Honestly, I wasn't expecting this. Uh, the way how it moved, I was thinking it will either stay the same or it will retrogress more. Uh, but fortunately, it moved further. For most countries though. So again, this is for the EB3 or employment-based type of visa coming to the United States. Which is most nurses will be under this. Except for the recent one wherein some of the nurses are coming through H1B visa. But for now, let's discuss this, okay? So for the first category, for the chargeability areas except those listed. From 8th of September 2022, now it's 22nd of November 2022. So they move forward 2 months and 14 days. Then for China, unfortunately, from 1st of September 2020, now it's still the same for September 1st, 2020. So no movement for China. Sorry guys, but no movement. Uh, but at least it didn't move backwards, okay? Then for India, namaste. From 1st of July, uh, 2012, now it's 15 of August, 2012. So it did move forward. And if you see throughout the chart, guys, uh, India has the most retrogression uh, period. So theirs is from 2012. So they have a 12 year period of retrogression. So that's really a lot compared to the other countries. The next for Mexico, from 8th of September 2022 last month, on April it will be, on April it will be 22nd of November 2022. So there's a movement also. Then for Philippines, from 8th of September 2022, now it's 22nd of November 2022. So there's a two month uh, period movement. So for the three countries, they moved two months and 14 days, and India moved like uh, one month and 14 days. So it is a good news for those who are included for this particular month. So for those who are new here, this is all a priority date. So if you're gonna apply for a USRN coming to the United States via an EB or employment-based visa, you will definitely be given a priority date where employer will apply for you for I-140, and on that date when they applied, that's the date that will be yours. That will be your priority date. If you find an agency or an employer on this particular month, most likely your priority date will be on a date that will be applied on this particular month. Okay, so this is what's going to be based on. So again, congratulations for those who are waiting for this movement. I know it's just like a short movement, but for those who are included for this two months and 14 days movement, um, it means the world to them. Okay, so again, thank you. See you next time.